Ferrari has unveiled its new convertible, the Roma Spider. But is it looking any better than the Portofino M? What are the key technical differences with it? And is it going to replace it? Let's get started. The new Spider is able to match the performance figures of the Roma Coupe thanks to finally engineered aerodynamic solutions. The carbon fiber tub of the coupe remains, but with modifications for increased rigidity due to the lack of the roof. The Spider represents the first soft top Ferrari convertible since the times of the F430 Spider that ended production in 2010. What else is the first front engine soft top since the 365 GTA 4 of 1969? The overhang of the sports car has been revised with tweaks to accommodate the soft roof. The weight increases of 84 kilos to 1650 kerm due to wind deflector that rotates the backrest of the rear seats into position behind the two front heads of the two seats. It features a soft top that can be opened in just 13.5 seconds at speeds up to 60 km an hour and comes in various tailored options. Inside, the 8.4 inch floating display remains as the 620 horsepower 3.9 liter twin turbo V8 engine. Same for the 8-speed dual clutch of the SF90, 0.62 miles per hour in 3.4 seconds and a top speed of 200 miles per hour. Pricing yet to be confirmed, but could be around the 190,000 pounds, 230,000 US dollars at the current change. How will it sound? Very similar to the coupe version here, thanks to Automo. Link to this video in the description. How it compares to the Portofino M that actually this model is set to replace? Let's have a look. First of all, Portofino M, M stands for Modificata from the previous Portofino and it represents the entry stage to Ferrari's lineup. The main difference with the Roma? It's the hard top. And what else? Well, from a design point of view, there isn't the elegance of Roma or the striking impact of the F8 Spider, as also the magazine Evo pointed out in one of their articles. But it's definitely a Ferrari and it is easy to recognize it as such. The 3.9 liter is still the flat plane trunk, twin turbocharged to V8, with bulb opening increased by around 1mm above intake and exhaust valve sets, adding about 20 horsepower to the previous Portofino and reaching 620 horsepower. The rear wheels are driven via an 8 speed dual clutch gearbox, too, as the Roma. Claim top speed is 200 miles per hour and 322 kilometers an hour, and 62 are reached in 3.45 seconds. Weight is of 1664 kilos, with a price starting at about 180,000 pounds, 220,000 US dollars. It's more expensive, agile, and entertaining to drive than a Continental GTC that starts at around 167,000 pounds and more refined than a Porsche 911 Turbo S Cabriolet starting at around 165,000 pounds. Of course, as with any of these sports cars, start adding some options and the price will change completely. Being a Ferrari, the used value is not too bad, with many examples on Autotrader UK at more than 190,000 pounds, like this beautiful one from GVE London at 280,000 pounds from 2022 and only 500 miles on the clock. <laughs> No exposure, I just wanna be a loner. Uh, some can't stay sober, looking over all their shoulders. Like moving boulders just to get out of the home. It sucks, I've had enough. I don't wanna feel the stuck under the rug. All my problems that I shove. So, what is your pick? The new elegant Roma Spider, the hardtop Portofino M, the mid engined F8 Spider, or one of the rivals? Leave a comment below. And I'll see you in this video about the all new 2024 Mercedes GLC Coupe versus the BMW X4.